Hi everyone, it's Tara, so welcome back to another video. So today's video is going to be Adidas's latest collaboration with the one and only, the queen herself, Miss Beyonce's activewear brand, Ivy Park. Now, I'm not gonna lie, this is one of those collaborations that I have very low expectations for. Like, I'm not really expecting to like it that much, but we're gonna give it a try. We're gonna see what it's all about. I've been seeing all over the gram, all the celebs getting their stuff, and I was like, you know what? Let me try it. I was not able to get a lot because obviously everything was out of stock by the time I got there. So if you guys are interested to see what I got, definitely keep on watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoy. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media at TerrasaX. But other than that, guys, let's do this. <laughs> I feel like I just look wild. <laughs> oh my gosh okay so this is the next type of fit as you can see we got the hat we got the top and then we got the joggers i'm just gonna throw it out there i was not able to get a lot in um this collaboration i'm even shocked that i was even to get stuff um it was a madness i had to do three separate orders just to get the little that i had so you know this is all we've got but let's start off with the top half of my body okay so we've got this beanie and as you can see on the side it just says ivy park and um adidas i have the tag on because i don't think i'm going to keep it and the reason why i'm not going to keep it is because this bright orange like this bright orange in your face vibe not even really a neon or type of orange i don't know if i'm a big fan of it however i feel like the right girl the right swag the right vibe can make this beanie look really really good what i will say it's a very good quality beanie like i've bought beanies for 10 pounds five pounds you can definitely see that they're quite cheap this one is very stretchy if you've got a big head like me i've got a wig on so my head is even huger at the moment fits perfectly if i wanted to put it all the way down i could um so it is a really good quality and i like just the little um logos there the top the top the top the top the top this is one of the things i think i was able to get into in my size um the top not feeling the top and i'm going to tell you why the top reminds me of a football soccer if you're in america it reminds me of that type of um kit like if you know what a football top or t football shirt looks like it's exactly like that just without obviously the team and the number at the back it's exactly that type of material which is obviously perfect if you're working out but i'm not buying these clothes for working out i was buying these clothes to look cute in so <laughs> if you're working out great it's amazing but um just for everyday -ish type of top i'm personally not a big fan of it it's got obviously all the stripes on it and then it's got these nice big stripes here and you've just got ivy park here and the adidas logo here so of course you can just see like the little collab between the different stripes i love the color i feel like this color in the collection is gorgeous i wish i had more piece there was more pieces in this color but this was quite expensive i'm going to break down the prices in a minute this was quite expensive and i just feel like for the price i feel like it could just be a little bit more oomph you know we could have got ivy park somewhere maybe something at the back I don't know but for working out purposes i feel like this is a really nice top it's nice and long you've got long sleeves so the beanie was 21 pounds and 95p and do i think it's worth 21 pounds and 95p for me personally no i don't think that's extremely overpriced because adidas staff as soon as there's a logo on it they hike up the price anyway so the price isn't unreasonable but for me personally i'm not feeling it like i don't feel like it's my vibe at all okay and this top oh well it's called soccer jersey my bad so it is supposed to be like a football shirt i didn't realize it actually says soccer jersey um so this was 44 pounds and 95p i got this in a size 10 um so it's a size small it is really oversized like the small is huge like i can't even lie i could have probably even done with like an extra small but um for 44 95 nah 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 i'm sorry it could be ivy park it could be adidas it could be i'm not spending 40 nearly 50 pounds on just this top for me it's a no-no but i do love the color i love like i feel like these two colors together look 
amazing so then we've got the joggers which i really do like actually i think they look way better in person um i got these in a size 10 and the size isn't the greatest best on me just because as you can see tall girl problems they are not fitting me that well i am super tall i'm 5 foot 11 so it doesn't fit the greatest on me but i do feel like these are really cute i think the maroon orange color looks stunning in the joggers like i really really do like these they're good quality um you can definitely work out in these but you can also definitely style in these i just like that the stripes are in the orange rather than having a lot of orange on it i feel like that looks really cute so the joggers are very expensive these were 69.95 pounds very 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 expensive do i personally think it's worth that it depends i feel like this is going to be one of the nicest things that you get in this collaboration something you can wear all the time which i do like about it and tracksuits as your tracksuits are always up there when it comes to the price anyway so if you've got the money i definitely recommend getting them because they are really cute i feel like you could style them in so many different ways which is what i love i definitely think if you could get that matching kind of crop top that goes with this and actually get the full track suit you would definitely get your money's worth and it would be amazing for me is it tall girl friendly hell no so if you're like over 5 10 i would say don't even waste your time because it's definitely way too short but if you are short and you want to spend the money and you can get these i highly recommend them i think they're very great quality um they fit really good that they have like different materials loads of different pockets Okay guys, so I don't even know what to say. But can I just first of all say, yeah, uh, when I saw this on her, I was not thinking I would like this. I thought this was gonna be stupid. I thought it was gonna be dumb. But guys, <laughs> I am feeling this. Of course, you're not really supposed to wear it out like this. I've only worn it like this because she's wearing it like this. And it's kind of, it's a bodysuit, but it kind of looks like swimwear. So I thought, you know what, why not? Um, I really like it. I really, really 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 like it like not gonna lie i like it a lot this could even look cute with some jeans i think this is banging i think this is i really do like this so um first of all can i just say some of the sizes that i got in this haul are not going to make sense this is a size 18 now i have been eating a bit good i have put on some pounds but i'm definitely nowhere near a size 18 i've got a size 18 because that was the only size left and to be honest it fits amazingly so i don't really know if it's just the ivy that's an ivy park collaboration that doesn't have good sizing or i don't know if it's me i don't know what it is but this is fitting really really well it's not too big or nothing like that if you live in england you definitely know what sainsbury's is and this is definitely giving me sainsbury's vibes but i'm kind of feeling it you can see there's the ivy and then the park on the side you've got this that zips up and down it can go all the way up like this or it can go all the way down and be proper open v-neck i am so impressed with this like this is one of the items you get and you think it's going to be stupid this is going to be dumb this ain't going to make no sense but when it came i love it like i really feel like it's nice it fits really really good you've got the little adidas logo there and then the signature stripes I really like it and this color is absolutely gorgeous I used to work at Sainsbury's way back when when I was like 16 17 years old so kind of gives me back the, these colors take me back to the times that I used to work there so not the biggest fan of the colors but of course if you've never heard of Sainsbury's these color these colors go together amazing like I feel like this is a big thumbs up from me then we have these leggings and obviously these are just strictly for me workout leggings like I would not wear these out I do like to wear cycling shorts out but the color has just put me off completely like I'm not a fan of the color but you can definitely tell they are great quality workout leggings they're not see-through you're not gonna have to worry about if you're working out and you bend over and people are gonna see whatever color knickers you're wearing you don't have to worry about that at all they're great 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 quality i picked this up in a size 10 so it was small and it fits absolutely amazingly um they were 34.95 again a bit up there in terms of the price for cycling shorts but considering these are gym active wear cycling shorts i can definitely vouch and say that they are great quality that like they look amazing they feel amazing they're very very super thick and like i said you don't have to worry about it being see-through also what i love about these is they are see-through on the side as you can see and then up here you've just got the ivy park and um, logo it's nice and straight so it's gonna suck you in in all the good places guys when i tell you i have no idea how to put this together i have no idea honestly i don't even know 
where it's supposed to be, how it's supposed to look. I have zero clues, honestly, zero clues. But if I am honest, I do really like it. I think it is really cute, it's different. And obviously if you harness yourself incorrectly, I feel like it look, can look absolutely banging. I love that it's completely in that maroon color. Like I feel like it's absolutely gorgeous. And of course, if you wear it with something white, or wear it like the jumper, like how she was wearing in the pictures, I feel like it can look absolutely stunning. But this was 84 85 pounds for this. And if I'm honest, I don't know. I understand why the price is so high. Of course, it's Adidas and it's Beyonce and it's Ivy Park. Of course, everything's going to be more expensive. It is great quality. You do have a lot of storage. If you're a trainer, a runner, and you run with this, you're going to be able to literally carry everything on you. But if you're just going to wear this out a couple of times, I don't know if it's worth the £85, if I'm honest. Let me know what you guys are thinking down below. And please let me know if you know how to put this on correctly because clearly I don't. This I love, okay? This I really 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 like i did have to get this in size 18 like the bodysuit because it did not have my size left but i could tell if this was in my size this would look banging so this is the infamous dress that beyonce looked amazing in i love it this is definitely not for workout if i'm honest like i would definitely wear this out it's just this gorgeous maroon color of course you've got the mesh sleeves you've got this nice kind of pattern on the top and as you can see here it says ivy park again you can zip it all the way down or you can zip it all the way up and then the bottom of the dress is like this asymmetric vibe it is way too big obviously because i got in a size 18 but i feel like this is the nicest piece in the collection this is definitely one of those pieces you can wear out you you can look cute in if you want to work out in it i guess you could but i would personally would wear it out i feel like it's absolutely stunning it's banging i feel cute in it this to be honest was the item that i was like okay i'm gonna like this a lot and um i do like it a lot it is 74 pounds and 95p but considering it is a good dress it is a nice good quality it is you know ivy park and adidas i don't think that is too bad i wouldn't mind spending 75 pounds on this dress because i feel like when I do finally decide to wear it, it would look really, really good. I feel like it would be one of those dresses that people would be asking, like, oh, where did you get it? So, very upset that I wasn't able to get it in my size. I definitely can't keep it for that reason. But if you are able to get it in your size, I definitely recommend getting it because it's really nice. It's really cute, really great quality. And okay, guys, so that is it for today's video. Overall, I am semi impressed with um the stuff like i said in the beginning of the video i had very low expectations and they definitely were raised up am i going to keep everything no do i think some of the stuff are a little bit overpriced yes but of course it's to be expected adidas is expensive on its own anyway and then when they collab with such a big force and such a big brand such as beyonce and ivy park it's to be expected that would be quite expensive but there is a lot of stuff that i love in this collaboration if you can get your hands on it um I definitely recommend getting some pieces i will leave all of the clothes that i got linked down below if they're still available i want to thank you guys once more for watching today's video and i'll catch you in the next one bye guys